Welcome to Sam and Kev's Outdoor Adventures. I'm Sam. I'm Kev and today we're heading to the Lake Christabel Hut, heading over the uh, Rough Creek track. Should be about six hours today and then we're heading out tomorrow out to Palmer's Flat. Should be a good day ahead, thanks for watching. Okay, we're about one hour in from the start of the track. Pretty much uphill at this stage. We've come up about 300 metres vertically. Um, so really nice beach forest. Um, pretty good so far. So we've just got to the two hour mark and we've just hit the bush line so hopefully it'll clear and the sun's trying to get in there but it's still a bit misty. Up we go, nearly at the ridge line. So we're about dead on three hours in, although we've uh, had about 20 minutes stop for lunch. And we've reached the high point, which is about just over 1,400 metres, so a 900 metre climb. Um, in behind me is the um, way over to Brass Monkey Biv, um, coming where we've gone from uh, where we've come up. Uh, we have our way down into uh, Pell Street Valley, and this way behind me is where we're going to Lake, uh, Lake Christopher, where we're heading off to. But they all kind of look the same because the clouds rolled in, so uh, we'll head out down there. So we're making our way on down from the saddle. It was very steep on the way down initially, uh, quite slippery underfoot. Uh, it's pretty nice though, um, even though there's a bit of fog around, we can still see some nice tarns and things like that behind me. So we've got Paul and Nigel with us on the trip today. Paul, how are you finding it so far? Good thanks Sam. Um, four hours in and we're on the Backside now, leading down into Lake Christabel. Um, it's sort of perfect conditions for tramping. Not too cold, not too hot, it's just right. We're just dropping down into the bush. Um, the weather's still really, really perfect, still is. And we're probably about an hour away from Christabel Hunt, I reckon. Alright, we're just heading down through the bush and back into rocky tree roots and slippery.
Quick tour around the Lake Christabel hut. It's an eight bunk hut. Uh, four of those are singles. Um, then there's two doubles. It's got a built-in log fire. A nice well-stocked woodshed, uh, which we are able to restock again because there's a nice fallen down tree in the riverbed. Uh, water, you've got to head down to the creek and fill up your bottle from there. Right, start of day two and we are underway. The rain is um, staying away for now, which is good. We've got about 20 minutes um, to get down to Lake Christabel. Um, so far the track's nice and flat and easy. Good start to the day. Right, we've made it to Lake Christabel. Uh, pristine, amazing ecological area in New Zealand. Um, interesting point about this lake, there's no introduced species at all, so no trout or anything like that, just native flora and fauna only. Right, we're in the So we've headed along Lake Christabel for about 5k and we're just about to leave and head up over the uh, landslide that blocked it off that formed the lake. Um, tempting to take alternative transport in the, uh, in the dinghy that we've just come across. There's an island out to the lake so uh, we're able to head out there but uh, probably not. So that brings us to the end of our um, tramp to Lake Christabel hut, going up Rough Creek and coming out via Palmer's Flat. It's been a pretty uh, pretty exciting day, quite a long day, a good six and a half hours so far. Mostly cycling alongside the lake and the river, um, a few interesting uh, sketchy areas but mostly pretty straightforward. I'm um, looking forward to uh, heading on out. So if you've enjoyed this video hit the like button, if you'd like to see some more hit subscribe and uh, hopefully we'll see you next time.